Let's talk about some wild claims floating around the internet because misinformation spreads faster than a toddler with a Sharpie on your white wall. Claim number one, there are no safety tests done on any of the 72 plus childhood vaccines. Reality check, how these outlandish statements reach the anti-vax playbook, I will never understand. I vaccinate myself and my kids and would never let them have a vaccine that wasn't safety tested and monitored for safety. Every vaccine given to kids undergoes a rigorous multi-phase development and approval process before it can be given. Step one includes research and discovery. Scientists spend years identifying the right ingredient to train the immune system. Step two, preclinical testing. Before humans get involved, vaccines are tested on cells and animals to check for safety and effectiveness. Step three, which is the clinical trials. Phase one can include small group of volunteers for safety. Phase two, hundreds of people help determine the right dose. And phase three, thousands of participants confirm it works and is safe for the general public. And step four, the FDA reviews all data. It's submitted to the FDA for approval where they review everything, inspect manufacturing sites and ensure the vaccine is safe and effective. And step five, continuous monitoring. Even after vaccines hit the market, they're continuously monitored through massive safety systems like VAERS, the Vaccine Safety Data Link and the Clinical Immunization Safety Assessment Project. And every pediatrician in this country who gives vaccines, like myself, speaks to families. And then we follow up. I follow up with my families at next visits to discuss how they're doing, if they saw any issues. We all would be sounding the alarm if there was a concern. So no, vaccines don't just appear out of nowhere without testing. That's like saying crash tests don't exist for cars. The process is literally built with safety in mind and want actual proof? Check out the CDC, WHO, or immunize.org. Not some random Facebook post written in Comic Sans with a stock image of a crying baby. Claim two, RFK sued Fauci for calling him a liar about this and RFK officially won. Yes, this never happened. There's zero record of RFK Jr. suing Fauci for defamation or winning any such lawsuit. If this had actually happened, it would be headline news on every major outlet and not just on conspiracy forums. RFK Jr. has spent years making unsupported claims about vaccines, but no court has ruled in favor against Fauci on this topic. So where's the lawsuit? Where's the court ruling? Spoiler alert, there isn't one. If you ever see a claim like this, ask yourself, where's the actual proof? If all they have is blurry screenshots and trust me, bro, energy, or it's real, just Google it, it's probably nonsense. Vaccines are tested, RFK didn't win any lawsuit against Fauci. Next time you see a post like this, don't just believe it, fact check it. And if you want real information, like I said, go to CDC, World Health Organization, or immunize.org. And if you want conspiracies, go to your local Instagram page where the person in their bio has thinker, truth seeker, DM for 50% off supplements.